Hey everyone, I'm the Lone Wolf, and welcome to Broken Through by Geordie Boy, I believe. We also made the shopping list, which I have not played, but I do plan on playing that in a Three Scary Games video that coming up sometime soon, whenever. Um, as always, the link to this game's page will be in the description below. I found this on itch.io. I think that's the only place you can find it. So, let's begin. Now, this is a spooky game. I can't remember what the description says either. Ava Williams' son, Leo Williams, went missing countless... Oh, countless investigations and countless searches took place, but no glimpse of where he went. Seven years after this incident, Ava Williams got a letter saying that Leo Williams was declared legally dead, since they never found any evidence as to where he went or where he is now. Oh, so that seven years is all it takes. I guess that that is reasonable. I mean, if you haven't found anything in for seven years. Well, that should be everything. That's a terrible impression of a female. Thank you for stopping by. I know Leo would have wanted you to have some of his stuff, knowing how close you two were. But anyways, I guess I'll head back inside now. Drive safe, okay? Alright, take care. Bye-bye. That is... Let's get all these boxes on the truck. That is a very bad impression. Okay. In the car. Alright, so what's going to happen to us on our way home? Broken. Oh, broken through. Created by Jordan Lindgren. So I guess Geordie Boy is the the itch page, the itch account name. So what's with the jazz music? Seems like we go back in time. Probably not though. Oh, you're not actually gonna make me drive. Wait. Yeah, is this yeah, this is the right side of the road for America. I'll stop by 11-7 and get a bag of chips before driving home. Oh, oh, T turn the car. Hang on. <laughs> Do I have my seatbelt on? I hope I have my seatbelt. So yeah, this is another game in the... PlayStation styled fun. I think horror games do really well with the PlayStation styled graphics. Well, I, I can't. I just park there. Oh, not bad. Not bad parking. Right, so we're entering the 11 7. 11 days a week, 7 hours a day? I don't know. Wow. Um, snacks. <laughs> Mushroom soup, cheese. That Campbell's? Campbell's soup? Can I can I get a bag of chips? Dory toes. Yep, get some of that. Oh, spicy noodles. I should have grabbed my spicy noodles.
Oh, I got my Doritos. Doritos. Hey, I'm just getting these chips. Alright, let's see. That'll be two dollars for ch Wow, that's good price. But hold it. Do you really want to buy that bag of chips? It barely has any chips, just there. Um, yeah. Maybe I could interest you in buying my own brand that I'm working on. Jordan's Jolly Jipper, 0% air, 100% chip. I even made a commercial for it. I don't think I'm interested, sorry. Do you want to see the commercial? Maybe it'll change your mind. Actually, yeah, let's let's have a look at this commercial, I'm curious. Jordan's... Excuse me, what? What the fuck? Please buy it. Hell no. <laughs> okay then. Well, it is two dollars for the chips only. I'm just gonna do two. <laughs> yeah. Oh, alright. Bye. But I wanted to get like. I wanted to get like, um, spicy noodles. I like spicy food. What the hell was that advertisement? That commercial? Or whatever it was called. I, I hated that. Wow, that's good. I didn't even check my rear view mirror. I can't even check my rear view. I don't even have a rear view mirror. <laughs> Am I stuck on? Oh. Can I change the station? Apart from that, it's not a bad drive home. I should have grabbed the noodles instead. Would have been much more safe. Alright. Time to go eat my chips. Probably let's open up a a flavoured drink of some kind. Maybe a Coke? If we've got any in the fridge. Based on a recurring childhood nightmare. Oh. Alright. I don't remember any of my nightmares. Exit living room. Well, I might as well open the boxes before heading to bed. Food Fumbler 4000. Well, here we call it a microwave. I'll stay inside. It's cold outside. 
Bunch of books. Ugly clothes. A game? I should give it a try on my computer. Posters. What's happened to the music? Why is it going all sad? God, why do you have so many windows in your house? Use arrow keys to move, navigate, select, interact, center. Do I have to use the arrow keys? Can I use the WASD? You have a choice. What's my choice? You're not going to give me my choice? Why is it getting darker? What, the, the um, computer screen is getting... That's noticeably darker. Mm, you've got long arms, I don't like that. What are you? Don't continue down this path. Why not? Give me a reason. like this. Oh, what the f what the hell is that? I don't like it. Beware of the man in the coat. Can I can I leave? This is not fun. It's horrible. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, I don't want to do it. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus Christ! No, stop! Oh, my God! What the hell was that? Wait, that's my house. That's here. Not, not, th that's the game here. Objective, exit your room. What the hell is going on? door shut but this ain't my house mate this isn't mine oh god what is that Th that's a sign <laughs> the game has just begun what is this nightmare on elm street i don't want to look behind me Finish four of his levels, or undergo a fate worse than death. Is this what happened to the- to my friend? To finish a level, locate the door. Is this one of the levels, or is this like the main menu of it?
Beware of the entities. Oh, God. Oh, it opens up. Well, I'm just, I'm just getting sucked into the level. I hate this. Can I leave? As I crossed the bridge, I had tears in my eyes, and I simply imagined myself diving into the water and drowning myself. Tom Thomas. Who's Tom Thomas? Level one, the bridge. What do you, do you want me to do? You want me to jump into the water? This is a really long bridge. Kayak. Is that a kayak or a canoe? That'd be a canoe. Maybe. I, I don't know. I got a, a, a looking thing. What are they? Oh. That's lovely. I am feeling really uncomfortable playing this for some reason. I I think it's because I play a lot of games. If, if something started to come out of one of mine, I'd be terrified. Just one second, there is something I need to do. I'm... I'm getting a phone call. <laughs> okay, I'm back. I hope nothing scary happened. Oh god, don't do that, no. No, please stop. Oh, what the hell happened to him? I don't want to stop moving, I gotta keep moving. Move when you move, you're safe, right? That was a good jump. A very, very good jump. Oh look, the door. That's level one done, right? That means there's three more to go. I'm getting sucked into the next level. Is 
Sometimes I wish I could just close my eyes and then be in a better place when I open them again. Tom Thomas. Who is Tom Thomas? Oh, what? Oh, I see. So red, green, blue, yellow. I need to probably need to count how many there are. One, one red, two red, three. Three red. Um, three red. One, two, so three, two. What are the other colors? Three, two, one, two, three, four. So three, two, four. Three, two, four, one. I don't like this place. Ah, oh, this is this going to be like that SCP? Was it O eight seven? I think think that's the name number of it. Close them immediately when you see them. When you see him. Ah, oh, close my eyes. The little... The little messages are... At the beginning are telling me what, the, what each level's about. Okay, so I can't move when my eyes are closed. Well, what does he look like? I guess it's the only thing in here with me. Yep. Nothing in there and I can't do anything with it. Oh, I don't like this. Not a fan. What? Well, That's just a missing sign. I want this just to end. I haven't seen this thing yet. Getting close, aren't I? <laughs> Oh my god! Oh. I had my finger ready to do that. I don't even know what that was. Another missing poster. Multiple missing posters. 
Oh, I... Why do we play horror games? Why do we play things to scare us? Or make us feel... I can't do anything with that one. Or make us feel uncomfortable. Is it the same reason... Um, people do things for the adrenaline, like skydiving, they drive real fast, race cars... mean? I don't even envy sloth greed um lust gluttony pride wrath greed Okay, we just... Oh, I don't like this. I don't want to go. Don't make me go. No. No. God, what's this one going to be about? Alright. Alright, so this is going to tell us what, we, what mechanic we're going to have. When me and my wife got divorced, I could still feel myself crawling after her and the darkness crawling after me. So I'm going to be crawling and there's going to be something following me. Right? That's what I'm taking from that. I don't like this. I keep saying that. It's All right, let's just just move forwards and not stop. Just got my finger on that W key. I don't even want to look behind me. I just did then, but oh god, no, no, no. Divorce agreement. I thought I could hear something behind me, but it's just my... just me. If I come to another crossroads, I'm probably going to go left again, because what are the chances of them having the left blocked off twice? See? Then the next one's probably a right, because you don't want to... Oh god, what's behind me? I'm not looking, I'm not looking. I refuse. If I look behind, I'll get slow. Don't do it, don't do it. Don't look, don't look. Don't do it, just... I'm so tempted to look. 
Okay, there was nothing. What was that red dot? Right behind me. What was that? Oh, that's the end of that one. That was the end of level three. Oh. I don't even know what was chasing me. There's probably something horrible. So I was right with what the sign said what was going to happen. I am done. I finished the game and now I feel much better. I feel like a different person. The man in the coat. So, so Tom Thomason or whatever his name was is the man in the coat. The creepy man. You know, this is a game you should never play. If I ever see a game called The Fourth World or whatever it was called on the box, I'm, <laughs> I'm not playing that. Stage 2. Level 4. Fourth World, yeah. This is the game. This is the game I was playing. I'm the 2D character now. I just thought they kept the pixel art style background. We are all as human as you are. You're our only hope to save us all. Tom Thomas has been corrupted by the entity including his game. The entity transformed his creation into an endless loop in which Tom Thomas relives his darkest times in life over and over again through each level. The entity feeds off torturing the innocent by luring people into this corrupted game. But if you bring Tom Thomas back, you bring all of us back. Was it like evil Jumanji? Okay. Barney Gray. Missing since the 5th of January 1992. January 1992. Okay. Am I supposed to remember that? Carlos Bull. Missing since the 12th of September 1993. Last seen buying a game. Dave Owens, missing since the 3rd of May 1994, last seen in his bedroom. So that's that creepy face we saw at the beginning. The next thing will be the man in the coat, won't it? That's a bigger orb. Leo Williams, missing since... 2nd of March 1995, last seen playing a game by a lake. That's where he went missing then, right? Oh, it's just you. Many people who have gone missing have actually just ended up here. Do you know anything about Leo Williams? Ah yes, he is the one who has gotten the farthest in the game out of us all. Are you too close by any chance? He was my best friend. He went missing seven years ago and we all thought he was dead by now. Well, in that case, I could help you catch up to him. 
There's a glitch on this map that will spawn a door. This door will send you back to your reality for a very short amount of time. If you manage to make it to the same place where Leo was taken into the game, you will end up at the same level as Leo as Leo, when the man in the code brings you back into the game. To do the glitch, all you need to do is spam the spacebar when you're a bit further out. Also be cautious when you're back in your own reality. The man in the coat might try to kill you by breaking the rules. Good. Oh, great. Thanks. Oh, I just spam spacebar. I'm spamming it now. Nothing's happened. <laughs> Alright. This is going to be horrible. Is he going to be a 2D man in coat or a 3D monster? door. Get in the car and drive. I don't know where to drive. I don't know where the lake is. Get on the correct side of the road for this country. Oh, Jesus. What are those? Ooh. One of them is going to pop up right in front of me and I'm not going to have time to react. almost there. This must be the home stretch then. God, it's happening! Uh, we're going in again. Player two joined a level. That must be me. I must be. Um, well, obviously that's me. I. No thanks. Please put the light back on. Please put the lights back on. I'm asking very kindly. You switch the lights, but I want them on. Oh. Leo? Please help me, Evan. Leo. Are you kidding me? A
Do I need to remember these people when they went missing? Ah! Oh. Level 32. How many levels are in this? I'm just following the path. I really hope this is the right way. Um, am I just going in circles now? Or is this place really this big? There he is. Barney. Why should I even try to progress anymore? I'm just gonna end up dead in another level. I can help you if you help me. I don't need any fucking help. I'm fine with staying here. I can get you home. Home? Yes, I just need you to trust me. Do you trust me? He doesn't even know us. You're asking for trust. Well, I guess in that stage any helps help. Any person. I trust you. One out of four souls saved. Level whatever, Dementia. Help Carlos Bull. I feel lost. Or what, maybe this will help. A vinyl record. Yeah, music helps everybody. Everyone listens to music when they need it. Um. Oh. I remember this. I used to listen to this tune all the time. <laughs> the kids always used to beg me to turn down the volume. And me and the guys used to play cards while listening to this. <laughs> So he probably doesn't even know he's in here. Those memories warm my soul. Two out of four souls saved. Level 125 depression. Help Dave out. Now this... Tom Thomas mustn't have been in a very good mental state. With all these levels, they're pretty hard hitting topics. I... No. Leave me alone. Hey, man, is everything alright? No. What's wrong? I don't know. I just feel so empty. I hate the feeling and I can't even explain why I'm feeling it. Hey, listen. There will always be moments in life where you feel as if nothing matters. The feeling that you'll never feel better again. And an urge to give up on everything. But I promise you. It gets better in the end. Please don't isolate yourself. I'm here for you if you'd like to talk. I'd like that, actually. You're not alone. Thank you.
3 out of 4 souls saved. Um, I can't read that second, oh, level error, grandson's safe zone. What's that mean? Have I been forgotten, Evan? Did anyone even remember me after I di I disappeared? You haven't been forgotten at all. I've missed you so much, Leo. And so has everyone else. Evan? I want to go home. Four out of f- oh, I gotta save my own soul, don't I? Yeah, that's a copyrighted song. Isn't it? Save Tom Thomas. I think the song's quiet enough that I won't get in trouble for it. Just that when it started playing, I thought I knew what the song is. I think I still do. Gee. Uh, is all the music in this game copyrighted? Thank you, Evan. You have not only saved me, but you have saved us all. I can now send all of you back to your families. Aren't you coming with us? Um, yeah, aren't you? I'm fine with staying here. You have already killed the entity, so by staying here I can live in peace. Here I can be truly happy. But now I think it's time for you all to return home. Thank you, Evan. And if I lie, then rain should fall from heaven. Alright, let's leave. It's weird seeing a game have a happy ending like that. Oh, well, can you... Yeah, you... yeah, this is gonna be copyrighted music. Oh. Missing boy found alive after seven years. Wow. That was a really good game. I would have paid money for that. And he did all that himself. Wow. Very, very nicely done. That's right, I forgot these were based on the nightmares. Kiss me once, then kiss me twice, then kiss me once again. It's been a long, long time. I, th I think he should charge for this, like, like, I would have paid money for something like this. I don't always say that about the, the these sort of games, but this was really well done. 
I am going to check out pretty much as many games as I can from this creator. That was really, really well done. There was good scares at the beginning, uncomfortable and um, environments that made me just really want to just get out of there as quick as I could. I have no idea what that thing was that was chasing me in the vent, but I mean, maybe there was nothing actually there, and it was just the da an actual darkness. That, that was really good. I'll make sure to check out more games from this creator. That was broken through. If you enjoyed the video, you can leave a like. Tell me your thoughts down in the comments below. And if you want to see more just like this, and you don't want to miss anything, you can always subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.